And your professional esteemed opinion, Dr. Bill? I think he's sleepy. <laughs> you think he's sleepy? Sweet. Yeah, looks pretty sleepy. I think it does have a little stink to it. Hey, there it is. Let me see the flashlight. Here. Uh, oh God, here. No, here. Better. Yeah, this way. Yeah, he's got a magic flashlight. <laughs> Sorry. He's got a lot of tonsillar inflammation back there. That's what I was worried. He's getting infected from his infection in his socket. That was a nice swallow. You guys be ready to leave. Mm -hmm. Just in case. Okay. Oops, sorry. Sorry. I, uh, I will, I will back up. Little green. No, I don't have the elevator. Elevator. Mm -hmm. Oh, God, that stinks. What do you want? In the plastic bag. Ziploc bag. Four by fours. Are you dry? No. Chlorhex. Do you want a, have a clean dry one. syringe full of anything? And then Do I? Yes. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I have four. Okay. Oh, hold the flashlight. Like. No, don't, not a clean dry one. I just wanted what? this one. Okay. Never mind. Oh, I didn't know. Did you want like a syringe of chlorhexidine? No, we use this. Oh, okay. <sighs> he does have some jaw tone. Yes, I know he has jaw tone. <sighs> He's pointing at you though, so I'm not worried. Sorry. I'm... It's a lot smaller than during the surgery. Mm-hmm. Contracted nicely. Okay, I need the light to go right at this angle. In the here. hole. In the hole. Come on, Laura. Get it in the hole. Trenched out for. No, nope, I'm happy with that. For now. Try to warn the back side of that tooth, too. That's from fence biting. Oh, Dr. Bell, did you know that that's the vomeral nasal organ at the top of the mouth right there? Which one? The, the, the one that's this right, one right there? here? Yeah, the one right there. Wow, man, you're so smart. I am.
Where'd you learn that? I, you know, just kind of pay, you know, just stuff. Pay attention to pick streets. things up. Yeah. yeah. Oh, this is actually a good opportunity to show. Can you can you can you talk just really quickly about the carnassials and how they how they uh, operate? How they act like kind of like scissors? These guys or these guys? The back teeth. The carnassials. Carnassials. Yeah, yeah. carnassials too. I thought I said carnassials. 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 You can see how this a one's. A, it's the same thing. This one's pretty worn here. Yeah. So, these guys back here act like a pair of scissors. Let me have his mouth there. Okay. We'll pull his tongue to the middle. So we don't bite his own tongue. So as they close, they shear. Just like a pair of scissors do, going side by side. And that's how they chew. And they grab chunks of meat with their canine teeth. And they're round on the front, and they're sharper on the back when they're young. When they get older like this, they get a little worn. They grab, they punctures in, and they pull back, and that acts like a knife and cuts it. Sweet. Thanks, Dr. Bill. Here we go. Yes. Are you rolling? Yes, I am rolling. You are rolling. I am okay. rolling. I got my fingers on either side of his calibarium, which is the bone that creates the, the brain case. Calivarium. Calivarium. <laughs> it's all the bones put together to make up the brain case. So everything from here out, all this stuff right here, this gushy stuff while he's asleep, that's all muscle to close his jaw. So is this back here. So all this is to, to create the bite. And the muscles to open his jaw is down here underneath, and it runs back up this way, and it's very small. It's probably not much bigger than my finger. A lot of pressure to close and not much to open. Makes sense. That's pretty impressive. Do you have any other like like fancy like medical words? That I Borborygmi. Bor Borber Borber Borborygmi. Borborygmi. That's a fancy medical word. What well, what is that? You know the gurgling in your gut? Yeah. It's called Borborygmi. Borborygmi. Very good. We learned something, folks. So we got in there, cleaned out the gunk, packed in some guys, gave him some, uh, basically, uh, some antibiotics out of the consistency of uh, Play-Doh, which is uh, yeah, pretty cool stuff. stuff. More like cock. More like cock, yeah. Mm -hmm. And uh, the, they, the antibiotics are, uh, they're going to last like, what, like four days, something four like days. that? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So hopefully that'll knock down whatever other crud was in there because you said that he had some inflammation like on his uh, on his tonsils there. Yes. Yeah. Hopefully that uh, that does the trick. And if not, we'll come back in here and try some other methods. Another go. Yeah. Alrighty. Super and duper. I think the day was successful. You need to go the other What's way. Sorry. What do you mean the other way? It's heads. It's so big. Yes. Okay. Hi. What you doing? Hanging out with Krista? What's making? Oh, that's delightful. What are they getting tonight? Spinach and sweet potato and grapes and banana and apple. Oh my gosh. Right? That sounds delicious. delish. Just delish. Would you like some spinach, Levi? No, I don't think so. <laughs> <laughs>